Hey, what's up everyone? Today I'm going to show you how to keep your core engaged when you're doing goblet squats. Hey, I'm Ryan Jankwitz. I'm a level 2 RKC and the owner of RJ Kettlebell and I'm on a mission to help men and women get in great shape using kettlebells. So when we're using the goblet squat, we want to make sure we keep our abs nice and tight to prevent any lower back discomfort. So there's several different ways you can hold the kettlebell. Um, I usually teach my clients to hold it by the handle or the horns, like so. But it's okay if you hold it from the bottom or even upside down as if you're about to do a halo. So whatever way you prefer to hold the bell is fine. The one thing we want to pay attention to is where the bell is positioned relative to your body. So I want to make sure the kettlebell is off my chest by an inch or two. When the kettlebell is touching your chest, your abs are turned off and people have the tendency to lean back a little bit. So I take the kettlebell off my chest, I immediately feel my abs tighten up and that prevents me from leaning back and putting stress on my lower back. And I'll just hold this position as I squat. So now I'm working the abs plus lower body plus my arms and shoulders are engaged to hold the kettlebell. So it's a great total body exercise. So just pay attention to where the kettlebell is relative to your body and try and pay attention to see if your abs are actually engaged when the kettlebell is off your body. If you have any more questions about kettlebell training, please send me a message. Stay strong.